Belizean Sweet Tikuno. In a wide pan on medium heat, add 12 ounces of sliced salt pork. Cut the sliced pork into one inch pieces. Place the salt pork in the pan. Cook moving the salt pork frequently until it is crisp. This should be about 10 minutes. Place the salt pork in a glass dish as each piece is done cooking. Allow the salt pork to cool. In a blender, add 30 ounces of canned whole kernel corn. If possible, get the can with no added salt. The salt pork will add enough salt. Add about a quarter of the salt pork into the blender. Then blend. Take one cup of canned coconut milk. Remember to shake the can before opening and pour that into the blender. followed by two tablespoons of vegetable shortening. A half teaspoon of baking powder and a half teaspoon of sea salt. Then blend. Pour the contents of the blender into a bowl. Add a half cup of brown cane sugar. and three cups of enriched yellow cornmeal. Mix until uniform. Add half of the salt pork. breaking off any larger pieces. And stir until uniform again. The consistency should be like thick oatmeal. Cut 12 pieces of 12 inch aluminum foil Now we're going to stuff the 12 large corn husks. Microwave a few corn husks for 15 seconds between paper towels. Use those same paper towels 
to keep the corn husk from drying out. This will make it easier to fold. Scoop in half a cup of corn mixture into each husk. The corn husk is important for flavor and to avoid Ducluno from drying. How to fold to avoid the Ducluno from leaking. Fold two edges and bring them together in the middle of the husk. Tightly roll the two pieces together towards the husk. Roll one side of the aluminum towards the side of the husk. Turn and repeat on the other side. Make sure the seal is tight and there are no holes. This dish is too good to waste a drop. Now let's get ready to boil. Bring a large pot of water on medium heat to a boil. I used a six quart pot and filled it halfway to the top. Then stack the dekudo upright to make it easier for later. Cook for 20 minutes. Loosely place the lid on the pot to allow the steam to come out. After 20 minutes has passed, turn the pouches around and cook for an additional 20 minutes. Place the lid back on. The kuno is done when it feels firm. Remove from heat and allow the kuno to cool enough to handle. Use a mortar to crush the salt pork into smaller pieces. Garnish with salt pork. Ducuno is best served with a side of conch ceviche. Now go and enjoy your Belizean sweet Ducuno with some family.